Your Honor, I, I stand before you today. Uh, I'm sorry. Somewhat confused. Boy, the dumb get dumber in this fucking world, I tell you. I'm gonna try making this fucking vid real fast because I'm tired of uploading shit on YouTube. It takes too fucking long. So I keep my videos short now, at least I attempt to. Alright, let me tell you how dumb this motherfucker is. You know what? You know what, Simpson? A normal motherfucker in your situation, after you committed the crime of the century, and you said you had a look, you were somewhat confused. You're somewhat confused like them defensive secondaries were back in the 70s when you rushed for 200 yards on them all day long, whatever. I think you did it three times in one year. You did it three times in one year. I think you did it two games in a row. You look somewhat confused like they did the defensive coordinators. You look somewhat confused like I did in 94, like the rest of the fucking world did in 94, when they found you were acquitted, when they found you acquittal. They look confused like that. See, a normal motherfucker, even myself being a pretty uh, bragging motherfucker, pretty um, abusive, whatever, even a guy like me, abrasive motherfucker like me, if I would have got away with the crime of the century like you did, you know what I would have done? I would have got, I would have seclusion, got a job, wouldn't have said a word to nobody. I would have never be on YouTube, I would have done nothing, nothing. But you had to go out and boast and brag about it, you dumb motherfucker. That's how dumb you are, Simpson. I don't believe in karma, but you know what? Karma might have got your ass. It might have snatched your ass up by the fucking balls and yanked your ass in prison. That's what it did. You dumb motherfucker. Looking back on your situation here, should you went out there and bragged all about this? Why would you do what you did in the motel room, you dumb motherfucker? O.J. Simpson's got to be the stupidest motherfucker I've ever seen in my life. And I got a little shout out to the judge now. Judge, I heard you was a tough sentencing lady. I'm a little disappointed in you because you could have gave him a lot more time. I thought for sure you were going to fucking throw a book at him. That's what I thought you would have Because I would have done that. I would have done that. Am I glad you people are like, man, this guy's crazy. He's glad OJ's in jail. Yeah, I'm glad OJ's in jail. You know why? Because I hate to see a motherfucker get away with a crime. At first, when he got away with it in 94, I actually liked OJ. I was glad he got away with it. I said, yeah, you know, someone can beat the system. I'm glad they can beat the system. But he went around being abusive and ignorant to the law, bragging about it, boasting about it, thinking it was over. Well, guess what? As I watch him right now standing like a coward in that courtroom, it ain't over because you're going to a minimum security prison probably. You're going to get punked no matter what anyone says. People are going to be not going to befriend you and they're going to punk the fuck out of you. And you're O.J. Simpson. You're a superstar. Guess what? You're going to have a rough motherfucking time, son. Trust me. I would rant longer about this video, but I want to get it fucking uploaded so I can get the fuck out of here. I don't want to. I hate uploading videos a long time. And one other thing. If this motherfucker would have been hiding in the bushes, if I went to his wife's house to retrieve some glasses and I'd have seen that motherfucker hiding in the bushes like them bitches do in Call of Duty 5. You know how they camp and hide in the bushes and they shoot you when you come around the corner like little bitches they are? If I would have went over there and seen this, 46 year old motherfucker with two bad knees, I would have whooped his motherfucking ass. That's what I would have done. I'm ending this video quick.